Daniel David Federman, M.D. was born in 1928 and died on September 6, 2017. He was Carl W. Walter Distinguished Professor of Medicine and the Dean for Medical Education at Harvard Medical School. He had helped transform medical education at through its new pathway curriculum around the early 1990s, and his groundbreaking work helped create the field of genetic endocrinology. He also worked for over 30 years from Boston's Brigham and Women's Hospital, a Harvard teaching hospital in the Longwood Medical Area. Before he was Dean for Medical Education, he had served as Dean for Students and Alumni. He later became Senior Dean for Alumni Relations and Clinical Teaching. He was also an endocrinologist specializing in diabetes and hormones and practicing clinical medicine in Brookline, Massachusetts. After he retired in spring 2007 and was succeeded by Edward M. Hunt, he served in Miami, Florida for over six years at the University of Miami's Miller School of Medicine. He has held many distinguished positions and received many honors during his long career. Those most pertinent to medical education are, President of the American College of Physicians, Carl W. Walter Distinguished Professor of Medicine and Medical Education at Harvard May Medical School, Massachusetts Physician of the Year, Distinguished Teacher Award of the American College of Physicians, Endocrine Society Distinguished Educator Award, AMC Abraham Flexner Award for Distinguished Service to Medical Education and the David Rule Medal, Institute of Medicine. His wife Betty passed on November 14, 2008. She had been born in Nashua, N.H., the daughter of Charles and Mary Buckley and had a brother Charles Buckley. They had two daughters, Liz Ann Federman Mann of Belmont, who had studied health policy and management at Harvard School of Public Health and later studied patient advocacy at University of Miami while her father taught there in a post-retirement career, and Caroline Federman Sosha, M.D., and son-in-law Albert of Chicago three grandchildren, Daniel, Julia and Michael, and cousins, nieces, and nephews. He did at 89 years old.